Hi everyone, welcome to another um, extra video. Um, I'm going to film a um, makeup video. The last one was of Marilyn Monroe and it has been some time ago. Today it's Halloween and I'm not really going to dress up or we're not really going to party, but <laughs> I just wanted to do some 80s makeup and hair to like dress up a little bit so um i would have like actually i was like i like on youtube to find see if they were or to look for inspiration and most of them i think it's maybe like the early 80s that they have the very bright colors and everything but um yeah I, I will try to find something like I don't have one video that I'm going to base this look upon but um, we'll just use some um, or I will just use my own <laughs> imagination or uh, and I've seen one like 80s um, clip on YouTube actually which I will link below but uh, I also um, take some inspiration from, from. Yeah, all the videos or if it all like um, also in the 80s videos we um, already started about or also we're talking about um, good moisturizing so that's something that hasn't changed and I'm using this one it's really one of my favorites um, as you see in my other videos, but uh, it's very good. Um, or pepper, or what is it called? Very energy boosting for skin. Uh, almost 30, so I, yeah, I'm using a bit more like, um, like effective skincare, or I really invest in that a bit more. Um, so good moisturizing, I really did that. So then we just started with concealer. If you know my tutorials or my uh, routines, then I usually only do it on the eye. Um, but you can use concealer for whatever you want. Then I'm going to use some foundation. really like the 80s because my parents are really like uh, 80s people. I grew up like since young. I mean they have different styles of music but like the 80s were very prominent and yeah. So my favorite music or I also listen to different kinds music but definitely 80s has always been like um, really like prominent or what do you want to call it <laughs> and um, like what my parents were listening both to or for example was a lot of like new romantic so um, Spongeo Ballet <laughs> and uh, uh, my dad more like simple minds, my mother more uh, Madonna as well with Spender Blay, um, especially. And yeah, I think sp simple minds were maybe a bit like new romantics, but also a bit more punk. I don't know if I'm wrong with naming them, just comment. My dad both like, uh, I think, new romantics, a bit of punk. <laughs> And my mother, especially like my daughter, my mother once told me that um, like in the 80s they were very like, maybe you have it still nowadays, but in the 80s what was really not done if you, if you were chose to be some kind of subgroup then you had also to stick to the clothing and like uh, music. Um, but I think it's really cool that both my parents 
Maybe we're gonna eat this into a mess, I think. <laughs> um, now blusher, I think. Um, or that's what I started with now. Um, I don't have really like a pink blusher, but it should be a bit more peach or like pink. And I'm going to use my bronzer for it instead with a bit of um, maybe pink if I find it somewhere, but I will just do a bit of contouring. And I said it was like, it was quite much on the cheeks. Or, but then like, um, what is it called? Raindrop, a water drop figure. <laughs> Or was it this way? <laughs> and because it's for Halloween, um, I mean, maybe it's it will look like pretty anyway, but we just go a bit like, try to go a bit more extra top of, or over the top or extra. Okay, then I do here as well, but the videos was not that much. It was more like cheek, cheekbones or cheeks. Actually, maybe we can use like just a pink mop lip liquid like for as a blusher stand because it needs to be a bit more over the top anyway. But I will do that later. We first to the eyes because I think that's the most tricky with 80s look because like the eyeshadow came up all <laughs> over almost like all over here like the like on uh, really under your eyebrow eyebrow even and yeah I think I also talked with it about with my mom one time um about what kind of subgroup I would fit in and she called more like her sister like older sister maybe a bit more preppy um she was more a Madonna <laughs> with her legs but I think so as well I just start with um a very pink color I probably will go a bit more use more like very light blue and um, pink color so it goes all up to the eyebrow for now for this time I also see like the more nude colors I also would be using like eyeshadow really until eyebrow there but that's more maybe a late 80s or 90s Really nice this <laughs> but I really want like the um, a Halloween kind of eighties look. I also actually <laughs> I still do, but um, some years or a couple of years ago, I really liked Rick Ashley, like the <laughs> the eighties music. Uh, my mother liked the kids, but she was only, yeah, or she was with him, I think, as well. But that's like maybe one artist that my parents not really listen to, but that I also like to listen to. So I can make quite much <laughs> just to create like a Halloween thick. Then when I was watching the video it was like well it's really a lot of it's even more than maybe we are used to if it's really like a whole makeup look. Felt really like a lot of eyeshadow. <laughs> They were creating like some kind of like some lot of depth or shadow 
in the eyes. So just adding some brown color in the crease and then also here. And then smudge, smudge a lot, or they also do, you could do it with your fingers even. Try. <laughs> and they use like an um, eye pencil. I'm going to use a blue one <laughs> just to make it a bit more. Henry ish different than I would use Shiny too. So um what did they say? Like not to really close your eye but to keep it like half open or keep your whole your eyebrow here and then just try to apply the eye pencil. Um yeah, so I'm going to try to see it in the video. I don't remember what they said. It, it was it should be like enough to thick line because and then they said in the video that it was a bit old fashioned. So I thought it was fine because the video was also already for two years old maybe. <laughs> and then under as well. And now I'm already going to apply some setting powder. I'm pouring it like very full, natural, but they use still set products for some um, brown mascara of Maybelline, which I'm using as well a lot. Um, like Halloween two years ago, I think we really celebrated at my mom's house. Um, she was living uh, at the time, like in a big. Um, Mention it old, so it was perfect for a Halloween party with her family and um, like uncles and aunts. And Philip and I, Philip also flew over, and um, I wasn't living in Sweden yet, so he came to the Netherlands. And I was, um, we were dressed up as Donald Trump, or Philip was, and I was uh, Melania. Also, the, I mean the other years, I think I was traveling, but uh, I also, the first year, I think we had a house party, not really, in Stockholm, but not really had anything, but I had this cat mask, <laughs> and I, um, scare fit my boyfriend with it, so. And like 86 something I always wanted actually, but uh, yeah, because of Corona, we just stay at home. I actually like Halloween as a house party. Um, I forget food and dress up and stuff. Brows are done, and maybe I'm going to use pomade a bit more often on <laughs> some daily routine. Uh, mascara actually for now I think both um you should get done on your eye but um they used to it in the video instead of watching under eye oh. <laughs> um like the movies there are really a lot but one there's a new one Thing of this year, uh, it's called Yubi Halloween, and if you have both liked it, could really watch it another time. But I think that's the new Halloween 
pay for it. Uh, Hocus Pocus, Beetlejuice. Um, there were a lot. <laughs> Stick. Oops. I mean, um, I have like this pink. Is it all I want? Which I maybe thought, but I thought that's cute, but maybe not really like Halloween of the top kind of for Halloween. Uh, 80s look. Uh, I have this pink gold obsession of L'Oreal. Maybe. And otherwise, this one, which is very, very bright pink, is in all. And this I would maybe do when we would have a party and I wanted to dress up with 80s or with an 80s look. So I think for today I'm going in for the pink gold obsession. So it's a very bright pink, maybe not as much as Esther is in all, but just bit extra. <laughs> we were also using some new liner, but I think I just used this one already. <laughs> wow. Some years ago I actually already did like a 80s look and I'm not sure if it was Halloween or when I was a student and then uh sent it to my mother <laughs> but um yeah I think it's so dumb I just want a bit more pink in my face in the face so I think I'm going to try with the pink gloss for one one Ooh. <laughs> And then I have to do my hair still. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, a bit more. So it's really like the bright colors. Eyeshadow, like different than we are used to now, I think going all the way up to the very proud and cheeks and then just fix my hair and hair needs to be like big <laughs> I know that of my uh, parents um, their siblings they are from that generation so it was always about like big hair, lots of hair. So <laughs> we'll try to fix that now. So I think <laughs> the makeup look is done. Um, like the I used blue with an eyeliner or an eye pencil, and I think that's a bit enough for now. And then just try to fix my hair. My mom me one time something about it but I think like usually because I have curls actually um like my hair is quite flawless <laughs> in itself so I have quite big hair but um let's try if I can make something good so I just did my normal routine straightened my hair I just brush it and then lots of hairspray, especially on top of the hair, lots of volume. <laughs> I'll try to see if I can fix it. I'm not that good with hair. But let's see. I think my mom said something like this, like to pay them something. Okay, hairspray. <laughs> oh god <laughs> shit <laughs> so <laughs> I hope 
comes in the hair it works a bit but i keep like brushing it and putting hairspray in it <laughs> but yeah i think i'm not sure if i can make more of this but it looks great it's to me so thank you for watching and i'll see you another time bye <laughs>